West Philadelphia, born and raised. Here it goes. Get ready for a junk ton of Insta stories. That's right, boys. I'm going on vacation. Oh, I'm going to bring, actually probably not going to bring this hat. This hat Rachel gave me when we were dating. So it's probably, I've probably had it 12 years now. I was wearing it when I proposed to her. So, very special, but I never get to wear it. I don't know if I'm going to wear it now. But we are going to Philadelphia tomorrow. Funny story on that. Uh, it was supposed to be next week, but I bought the wrong weekend for tickets. So, luckily, Delta sent us an email on Sunday, a reminder about our flights, which were non-refundable. And uh, look, there's five square, four squares right okay. there. That means your Insta story is too go. long. Goodbye, guys. Okay, everybody. We are on our way to Philadelphia. I was so rudely interrupted last night. My story. But yeah, y'all stay tuned. If you want to know what Philadelphia looks like, you can come discover it with us. We have arrived. We are in our hotel. About to go adventure. We have a beautiful view, guys. Beautiful view. Actually, there is a man on top of the building over here. I don't know who he is, but I'll find him. Okay, now we are at Reading Market, which I thought was Reading, just like I thought it was Reading Railroad and Monopoly, but it's not. It's actually Reading. All these years playing Monopoly, I was wrong. Yeah, it's true. First one, how is it? How many of these are we gonna eat this week? <laughs> Two or three. Pretty lady over there just hanging out. Got a man on a horse too. Well, I was actually wrong. That that building I zoomed into wasn't the rocky one. This is the rocky one. As you can probably see by the people lifting their arms up. Which are you going to do? You have to! Okay, we just did the rocky steps. Wow. Wow. How was, how was that experience? I almost got lost. The bathroom in this place is like a dark dungeon. You go downstairs, you can't even really see the signs. Black velvet curtains. Yeah, it's a little creepy. Well, we went to a really fancy coffee spot here, guys. Pennsylvania. It's really unique. I <laughs> gave it away. The Dunkin'. Why do you like Dunkin' Donuts? It's coffee. It's delicious. It's delicious. And it's not that expensive. So, it's kind That's of true. a win there. It's right up our alley. So today, we were walking across the city hall area and past this camera guy. Okay. And we were like, man, he just kind of looked like he was staring at us a little bit. And then someone just sent us a, a, a picture of their local news, apparently. Of us. And always. they thought Rachel was so pretty and cute. And they were like, we must get her on the news today. We're not the ones involved in the shooting, though, so I don't know what that is. <laughs> okay, well, we left the comedy show about, I don't know, you probably didn't even make it halfway through. We figured it was like five bucks each, so we're like, oh, you can't really lose. But that was so dumb. The like, are terrible. I don't, I didn't, I don't even know if I chuckled. Like, it yeah, was I think like, I smiled like two times, and then I cringed about 100 times. Hey, y'all, do you know why uh, Northerners don't wear skinny jeans as much as Southerners? 
because it makes you a lot colder because they're skinnier and they don't break the wind. Worth the darn! Okay, so it's not even like crazy cold outside. It's like in the lower 30s. But I think it's because of these tall buildings and you're kind of in the valleys that it's way colder than that. So I got long johns on. And we learned our lesson because a couple years ago we went to Boston and again, it wasn't like crazy cold temperature wise, but we were miserably cold. So got some layers up. I don't ever wear more than just like a t-shirt really and a jacket, but I am tonight. This is the show here of uh, Ben Franklin's house. And little uh, cornerstone footings under glass. And a very important piece of technology, the privy fit. What is that? Just like that. Hey guys, this is where I would be on every Friday night if it weren't for Rachel rescuing me. I'd be in the store playing a bunch of board games with the nerds. Settlers of Catan, anybody else? Come on. Falling through the levels of Interstellar. We are in. <laughs> Did you think this was going to be a picture? <laughs> okay. We're in the airport and we are about to head back home. Three days in Philly. It was fun. Had some good cheesesteak. Was the cheesesteak your favorite food there? Probably. They had these stuffed pretzel things have... that were pretty good too. I liked that a lot. So, a lot of all the cheesesteaks were pretty much relatively the like same. Four cheesesteaks in three days, probably. Yeah, we had several cheesesteaks and they were they were all pretty good. But I think the having the fresh bread in uh, the whiz. You gotta have Philly with whiz. No onion is how I do it though, but I'm just Wrong. weird, so I'm not be how to do it. <laughs> 